So, matching shirts and ties, how do you get the right combination? Every day I see people getting it wrong, but how do you get it right? There's such a bewildering array of different patterns, colours in both shirts and ties. Um, but luckily, we've got a few tips and hints for you to get that winning combination every day. So let's start with the white shirt, which is probably the easiest in the range, because um, anything goes with the white shirt. But there's one key rule, if you like, on the white shirt. If you could pick a tie with a little bit of white in the design, um, like this one here, it's really going to make the shirt and tie combination sing. So moving on to the solid coloured shirt, and here we have a sky blue solid. Um, the principle here is uh, you match up um, a detail in the design of the tie with the base colour of the shirt. So here we have the sky blue in this detail here, uh, and that will make the shirt work. So it works with any solid colour. If you had a pink or a purple, then just find a tie with a little bit of pink or purple in, and that will work perfectly. So moving on to the check shirt, which is a little bit more complicated. Um, here we have a combination which doesn't really work, um, and why it doesn't work is the, the, the tone of the lilac in the tie and the shirt really just don't match. So here's an example of the correct tone, and you can see that works much better. Now, because uh, the base colour of this shirt is predominantly white, um, you can go for a solid colour in the tie. So it's the reverse. And similarly, dots work really well with checks. And again, a solid ground in the tie. Stripes can follow the same rules. Here we have a classic Bengal stripe and a plain sky tie, which tones in very nicely. But if you're passionate about shirts and you want to make a bit of a statement, why not go for something a little bit more funky like this? This works really well because it's got that little bit of sky in the flowers, which actually pick up the base colour of the shirt. It looks fantastic. Now you've got the rules, don't be afraid to experiment. You can't go wrong.